audience. This is your host Cindy and you are watching the book reviewer and I have another book review to share. So last week I did the review of one of the James Harriet stories. It's a series. Um, if you check out my uh, last video, um, I'll put it somewhere up in the cards or the video description below, or both. Um, I talked about the animal series that I'm still working on. Um, I didn't get the next book in this series yet, but I'm still working on it and I decided to do something else. And I have something else to share. Um, always have a backup plan. That's one of the number one things you probably um, need to learn from this video. Always have a backup plan no matter kind of what it is. And sometimes you don't and that's kind of sad. Um, anyway, um, the book that I want to review today is this one. It's called The Art of Organizing Anything by Rosalie Maggio. I hope I said that name right. Anyway, um, there was a few months, probably about a year, that I was into organizing just about anything and everything and um, I found that this book was recommended to just about anyone and, and it came up uh, a few times um, during my reading and the tiny text list, the very tiny one, please read it. Alrighty, that was my phone. <laughs> My mom and I joke that that's uh, Elmo speaking and we think it's pretty funny. Anyway, um, so this book is hi highly recommended. This, the biggest thing that I learned from this book is that organizing does not have to be an all or nothing mentality. I know that a lot of women, especially, um, look at magazines, see the covers, see the pictures, and want everything just so. Or, you know, sometimes you have a situation where nothing seems to be organized, and then some people think that you didn't do anything which is really awkward just like right now anyway um so that was something that i found out and i was really pleased with in the book um another thing that i saw in the book was that there has to be a time investment somewhere. Um, they give an example in the book about installing uh, organizational stuff like the key hooks that you find, um, hiring somebody else to do a job that you probably do need to do but you can delegate. The time investment is let's say you misplace your keys a lot and you buy like a little key plaque hook thing I think most of you know what I'm talking about but um so you find get it and you install it it takes maybe 15 minutes but you look for your keys and it probably takes away about an hour a week to constantly look for them I think that time investment is really worth it because you can do a lot of things in an hour. You can do four 15-minute organizational sessions. You can 
watch an hour TV program. You can do lots of things. So another thing they talk about is the time investment is let's say you have a twenty dollar an hour job that you get paid to do and your lawn needs to be mowed so you strike a deal with a neighborhood teenager that wants to do the lawn for about fifteen dollars flat rate so you're getting paid twenty dollars an hour I think that's a worthy investment for something that maybe you can't do due to health issues or you are not able to do because of your work schedule so um, that is a good time investment if you do have the money to do that um, some people this isn't an option because they're either tied on funds or they don't make enough to pay somebody to do what they would like not to have to do but they do it anyway um so that's one of the things that I thought was pretty cool about this book um, this book was really well written it I think caters to the people that um, don't have a knack for organizing and they take you through just about everything computer files um, files and folders um, things like putting all your dishes in the kitchen or wherever you eat regularly um, things like that there were some things that I even got something from like the organizing uh, computer files and renaming computer files so you can find them easily um, that would work um, so there's a little bit of something for everybody here um, this is a great book I don't even really remember how much how many pages there are um, I'll put a note somewhere in this video of how many pages it was probably look it up on Amazon and find out excuse me so this was in essence a good book um, if you've read it um, let me do <laughs> let me know down in the comments below if you liked it if you hated it if um, somebody you know has read it they liked it they hated it let me know down in the comments below um, if you guys have a book that you want me to review um, um, put it down in the comments below and I just might pick your book to review again this is the art of organizing anything by Rosalie Maggio um, you can probably get it on Amazon I think they might have a Kindle edition I'm not sure um, your local library you can also get it as an ebook like I did um, so in essence this is a good book um, some people might like it some people might not it just depends thanks for watching you guys thanks for subscribing keep reading don't stop believing and we will see you again soon goodbye